Yes, yes, we're back, we're back. Welcome, everybody, to VR Citizen. Oh, so, a couple changes and some updates on why I've been gone. Uh, I got this sweet armrest that I can now use the throttle arm for long-term sessions back to back to back without developing strain in my elbow, so that's awesome. Um, but more importantly, I moved some refrigerators uh, with a friend and protuded a disc in my spine. So that's why I've been gone for about two or three weeks, but I uh, got the MRI and the doc says I got a nice strong looking spine. So everything is okay now and we're healing up pretty much at 95%. Um, the goal for tonight and, you know, every hopefully other day from now on is to be online and streaming some VR citizens. So if you're able to drop by and uh, catch me live, go ahead and do so. I'm going to be trying to set down some more consistent times. With that said, uh, we're just going to be chilling tonight and doing more of what we did the other time, except without cut and chopped audio, I hope. Uh, let's go mine some rocks with The Rock. Thank you for dropping by. I'm Chachi Sanchez, and welcome to The Verse. And let's get into some VR Citizen. Still on the fence about the Pimax Crystal headset. Still features not yet enabled, still some features needing improvement before I might bite on it. Hell, man, you might as well just wait like maybe another month or two. I'm thinking that when they finally actually drop Counter-Strike 2, uh, they'll be making some bigger announcements on top of that. Because there's no way they just do that. There's no way that Valve just drops Counter-Strike 2 without any other additional news. I'm sure there's some big, big, big plays that are coming into focus very, very soon, including their headsets. All right, everybody. Welcome to a new dawn. Ah, 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 ah. Trying to see that sunset. Ah, that, that. A new dawn ah, and a new day for VR Citizen. There you go. That's the shot I was looking for. Let's go. We should have everything we need. I got my gun, gravity tool, the rocks here. Oh, Persistent Universe is so nice, isn't, isn't it? Oh, baby. All right, well, let's get flying. <sighs> so, how you been, Zero? How's everybody doing today? Hot in Tokyo, just finished working out. Ah, it's 108 today. Can't be more than a... You're complaining like it's 120 degrees. Can't be more than a 114. But yes, it seems to be hot all over. The planet is dying. Uh, let's go mine on this desert and forget about that. <laughs> all right, all right. We got five. Not a horrible start to a night. Is it had a night is the name of the game. It is some had a night. We'll just grab it real quick. No sense in leaving that on the ground. On the table, whatever. All right. Oh, we're... Back to the pink? I thought I had the white and gold. I'll need to swap that out. I mean, you know, the pink ain't bad. That's pretty cool. But the white and gold is my favorite. Okay, okay. Yeah, I was thinking of getting a steering wheel for your own vehicle. It's a matter of space. That's the thing, is that you gotta have um, uh, over under. Um, uh, steering wheel and uh, tray for mouse keyboard or area for mouse over here by your shifter panel. So that's the only way that you can fit everything without it being like a wireless tray that you like do stuff over here with. But you want to be able to FPS play comfortably in the same chair that you're flying and driving in. So I feel like this is the best all arounder type setup. And I have a little bit of extra room for like some paneling like kind of right here as far as some buttons to push. I can't get in the way of the joystick so it has to be kind of mounted a little bit high. But yeah, like wheel, mouse, keyboard, shifter, joystick, throttle, you know, get an armrest on it if you can. It'll develop strain if not. And then, uh, yeah, you got a, a set of pedals that you could set up for, um, uh, what do you call it, flying and whatnot. Easy peasy. Ooh, the minerals are picking up quick tonight. Servos are handling nice. 
Alright, here's what I'm seeing, for those that want to know. The trouble I have is, as awesome as it is at first, that you got this head tracking, uh, then you realize as soon as you, you know, get to mining and you look at the info panel, it... Yeah, it's not optimal. Having an extra joystick setting, you know, to move the mining arm, or to having it toggleable, having this system toggleable be on and off would be great, because I do like looking at what I'm sucking up with the vacuum cleaner. But being able to turn it on to a mode that will let me either hold it there where I left it and look around would be great for the mining mode, like a, a, a hold feature, or just, you know, toggle in general. Or, if you know, want to go the extra mile, let me use my joystick to control it and feel like I'm actually driving a tractor. I can't see, it's so bright. Easy now. There we go. Isn't that nice? Yeah. Excuse me. Hello. Fell into my cab because it has open windows. <laughs> and then promptly fell through the floor because physics. Hey, what are you gonna do? It's a video game. Well, that fell. Ooh, fell through. Reminder. Alright, let's go. Drink some water. <sighs> drink, drink a lot of water. And then throw it in the trash. And by trash, I mean drop it in the corner here. Perfect. I'm gonna grab a blue beaver. We got a munch and crunch. Nice little purple space apple here. I don't think I'll have to throw away a core. So if I have a core, that would be so funny. I think, no, we just ate it. All right, brilliant. And then we are good to go. And because we're not dumb... Boop. All right, ready to roll. Let's go. Oh, my God. No! Oh! She's okay! Oh, I love that auto-flip system. That's the best thing they've ever added. You don't have to waste like an hour and a half to go get another vehicle. Alright! What were we doing? Oh yeah, had night. Uh, where? Where's that hat night? Parked like right on top of it, didn't I? Why are they not showing up? Oh my god, now they show up. Oh, get it in fracturing mode. If the mining days are out, then we'll highlight the mo the mining nodes. Oh, Alright, let's get going.
Gotcha. All right. Engine. We did find some after all. Not sure if it's had a night dolivine or a fluorite or whatever. But we're just going to hit it no matter what. So let's get going. Could use a bit of water. All right, cool. I had a guy who was telling me about VR. I was like, <clears throat> don't worry. I'm already way ahead of you. Oh my god. Okay, sorry. Really quickly, folks. Almost killed myself again. Dear Christ. Oh, <sighs> alright. Jeepus. We need to stop doing that. Alright. Wow. Folks, we're gonna get mine in here. We're going to be completely full on cargo here. So what I'm going to do is we're going to go back to the Cutlass store, what we got. Oh, hello. And then we will grab the last two. And then we'll go back to Grimhex. And uh, sell what we got. Now the problem that we got is we might have to actually board. Hang on, can we get a wheel? Wait, four wheel up. Ah, oh, come on, come on, just get it, get a lip on it. All right, hang on, hang on. I think I can do this. I think I can do this. Okay, it's on. Oh, uh, it bounced. Grip, 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 grip. Yes, infinite grip torque. That's what we like to see in every vehicle. I'm gonna be very sad when they change that. And it actually slips. All right. Traction control is gonna be a big thing in the future. Who to thunk? Okay, we made it in. Engines off. Turn off the lights. Get out. Oh, brilliant. And then let's move our load. Um, hmm. Oh, if I hit sort, if I hit sort and hit move all, it works. All right, whatever. Uh, dancing dino. I love it. Contact. 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 silent here. This is spicing things up a bit. <clears throat> Alright, they're flying just in and out of radar range. And they were definitely hot red. We're gonna get in the rocks over here. We're gonna be like Obi-Wan Kenobi. And we're gonna wait. You didn't know I was packing. Also, I can aim down sight, by the way, in VR. And then I could be checking my corner, you know, making sure no one's creeping up on me. Alright, we'll do this for like, you know, two to, you know, 50 minutes, and we'll just kind of wait it out. Make sure we're safe. 
<laughs> Two hours later. Seven, eight, nine, sixty. <sighs> All right, I think it's I think it's safe. <laughs> Let's get back to it. <sighs> this is a nice big chunk of Haddonite here. Really, really would love to be able to hit all of it. Alright. Close call with whatever was on the radar. Since it was two of them, I think it might have been like bounty AI targets, but it is also new flight week or free flight week, and a lot of newbies are being hunted down ruth ruthlessly? Recklessly? Probably both. Anyways, trying to avoid that, especially when we got a big old payday haul. Alright, let's get out of here. There we go. Now we're slicing through them like butter. Except it's so damn bright, this laser. And I'm so damn colorblind. I can't tell until the last second if we're actually in the pocket or not. Boy, if we could just turn the HUD different colors like blue compared to the laser's yellow. Or, I don't know, inside some sort of neon gas into um uh, into it and make the laser a different color that would work I mean they're already hand beam for fucking gravity beams might as well right we got a red one for this why can't we have a blue laser Whew. almost done here folks got a couple more uh how do I get out of this Okay, cool. All right, let's go sell and refuel. Oh, you know what? We might, this will depend, depending on what we find out here on this MFD screen, this will tell us where we're gonna go. Okay, so, the cooler is at 90% HP. Mining laser, mo rock mining arm. Okay, so yeah, the cooler. Priority reset. I don't know what that button does. Okay, so yeah, the rock will have issues sometimes. Uh, with it just dying on you because you overheated the laser. Uh, looks like the laser is fine, but I want to test to see if we can actually repair it on a pad at a mining camp. So we shall go to like Art Corp uh, mining area or something like that. And then, uh, yeah. We'll sell the stuff there and we will refuel the cutty and then we'll repair the rock. Get everything done at one location. All right, we come in hot. Oh, shit. Got my goddamn landing gear. That would have been a great landing. Slight overshoot, a correction, then I would have planted it down right in the middle. But no, we had to slide across the ground like a freaking rookie. Alright, kill the power. Kill the lights. 
I don't want anyone knowing we're here. From above. If we can't help it, let us get our business done here. First, we sell our shit. That way we don't go home empty-handed. Then we can go worry about repairing everything. Ah. Alright, sell. Grey Cat Rock. Oh no, it's not in the rock, that's right. It would be in the Cutlass. Okay, a thousand... 1,100 units of Hat Knight. 275k made today. On that alone. Plus another like 30 to 50k earlier. And then a 4 right. 73k there. So 325k made. We should be up to 1 point. Yeah. 1.1 million. Let's double check. Boom! 1.1 million. Very good day. We cracked over the six figure, seven figure mark, so go us. With that said, uh, if you're watching this as a highlight on YouTube, thank you so much for doing all the voodoo that you do. I appreciate everything and everyone out there. And, uh, yeah. Look to finally actually see me online a lot more often. Uh, until next time, as always, stay safe, fly right out there. Yeah. Is there anything cool I could look at while I sign off? Ah. Y'all have a good one. <laughs> Alright, I'm gonna put a marker down. We could chill for a little bit longer. I'm gonna do probably one or so more runs. Oh, wait, you know what? Shit. I need to figure out if we can actually repair the rock. Hang on, hang on, hang on. Not yet, not yet. What? It said too hot. What the fuck just happened? Did it shut down? Seriously? Like right now, right as I was 88 on the cooler, it took a it took a dinger. Ugh. Well, it seems to have died. However, maybe we're outside. Yeah, no. <laughs> Not gonna happen. Um. Huh. It just died on the ramp on me. Uh, so I guess this definitely does end our journey for tonight. Um. Yeah. Till next time, uh, stay safe and, uh, fly right out there. <laughs> <sighs> Star Citizen.